You filed bankruptcy and you stopped moving? You got fired and you stopped? Did you get divorced and you just stopped moving? You got cut and you just stopped? When my basketball career was over, I didn't stop moving. Why? Because I'm a shark. And don't you ever forget that the rest of your life. Don't you ever stop moving. Don't you ever go backwards. To be a shark is about how you move, how you operate, how you navigate. See, as long as we connected, my friend, you can't stop, you can't quit, I ain't gonna let you. Not on my watch, baby. Get back in the game, it ain't over till you win. You might say, well, that's me, man, I quit. I got lazy, man, I'm not moving, I'm landing in the bed, sad, lonely, depressed, angry because my girlfriend broke up with me, angry because my first business failed, angry because I didn't get into my dream school. Let me tell you, son, it's a long race. It's a long race. Life is a marathon, baby. If you stop running, you won't get to the finish line. So as long as you can hear the sound of my voice, don't you ever stop moving. Don't you ever go backwards. And sharks never retreat. Sharks never retreat. And those big, powerful creatures got close to the camera and all you could see was muscles and scars. Scars and muscles. Why? Because sharks know how to fight. Can I ask you a question? You got some wounds, you got some scars, but are you still willing to battle? Are you still willing to fight for success, fight for being wealthy, fight for getting out of debt, fight for your marriage, fight for your family, fight for whatever you gotta fight for. The thing I love about a shark, they never stop fighting. Don't let failure stop you. Don't you ever let rejection stop you. Don't you ever let people stop you. You stop moving forward because they said this and they said that. Let me tell you something about what he say and she say. Haters stopped you? Really? When you get successful, haters are a part of the landscape. If you don't have haters, your vision is too small. And then you have the great whites. Oh, then you got the great white shark, baby. They go deep. They love hunting in the deep. They are always going for the throat and they don't stop until they win. See, when you go to the swimming pool, most people stay in the shallow end, but not great whites, baby. Not great white sharks. They go into the deep end. They love going deep. For you to become a millionaire, you gotta go deep. Some of you guys gotta read more. Some of you guys gotta study more. Some of you gotta change your relationship. Why? Because your friends are shallow. Your family is shallow. And if you wanna be a great white, baby, you gotta get some new friends. You gotta get some new conversations. You gotta get some new material, new information, new access to new people that can take you to a place you've never been. All oh, great white, baby, they go deep. It's time for you to go deep. So whatever you put me in, I'm gonna make it out on top. Wherever you drop me off, I'm gonna make it. Why? Because I'm a shark. I don't care how many times that you need to try, no one can stop you but you. I don't care who you are. I don't care what you do. If you want to be a sales shark, you got to move different. You might still be in school. You want to be a straight A student? You got to move and operate differently. You a young, aspiring athlete in high school or college, trying to make it to the league, trying to make it to the top? You can. It's right in front of you. But you got to move different. You got to operate different. You got to operate better in the social circles. You gotta operate better in school, better in class, better in the sales meeting, better in front of the client. Why not? How do you move right now? I mean, let's be honest, how do you operate right now? And here's the truth, if you're operating the right way, you don't need to brag about yourself because others are gonna brag about you. Keep your own name out your own mouth and let others talk about you are a beast. Let others talk about how good you are, how strong you are, how fast you are, how smart you are, how successful you are. That's when you know you're a shark, when others are talking about you. You want others bragging about you. Sharks only look up, they can't look down. In fact, if a shark attacks you in the ocean, get beneath it, because a shark can't look down. See, when you're looking at haters, you know what you're doing? You're looking down. When you get distracted by haters, you know what you're doing? You're keeping your eyes off the prize, baby. 
Haters are a part of the landscape, but haters are beneath you. And the real truth about haters, they wish they did it themselves. The real truth about haters, they don't have the courage to go for it themselves. Sharks only look up. They can't look down. Stay positive, my friend. If it didn't work this time, try again. Oh, it worked the second time, try it again. No one can stop you but you. You gotta get to that next level through your movement. You gotta get to that next level through your activity. You gotta get to that next level by how you operate. Can you ask your question? How strong is your movement? What time do you wake up in the morning? What time do you go to sleep? And how much time do you waste throughout the day? Sharks never stop moving. Sharks never go backwards. Sharks only look up. Sharks never look down. And here's the best part about a shark. Shark takes others with them. Sharks make other people successful and sharks are made of cartilage. That's why they're different than every other fish. They're made of cartilage, which means they're flexible. They can change and they pivot when they need to pivot. Can I ask you a question? Do you need to pivot right now? Your business idea is not working. Pivot. Your marriage is not working. Change how you operate. Your career is not where it needs to be. You're made of cartilage, baby. You're flexible. Pivot. Make sure, ladies and gentlemen, that your mindset is to be a shark. Sometimes in the day you're a shark. Sometimes in that same day you're a sucker fish. But don't you ever be a parasite. Why? Because parasites connect and all they do is suck the life out of you. All they do is suck the confidence out of you. All they do is suck the momentum out of you. Why? Because parasites take and they don't give. All they want to do is take you down. They don't care about you one bit. They will take everything you got until it's all gone. They will take your confidence. They will take your self-esteem. They will take your money. That's what a parasite's job to do. They connect to a host and all they do is take. They'll attack your brain so you can't think right. They'll attack your nostrils so you can't breathe right. When you get connected to a parasite, their job is to destroy you. All a parasite needs is an opening. So you can't be weak-minded out here. You can't be desperate out here. You can't be thirsty out here. You can't be frail out here. You must have thick skin and be ready because a parasite can't mess with you if you have thick skin, if you're mentally tough and mentally strong and you know who you are and you know whose you are. Your next level is going to require you to have a mentor. Your next level is going to require you to get connected to the right person. Mentorship is a lost art. Mentorship is going to make you successful. Mentorship would save you time, money, frustration. I made it to the NBA because of mentors. I'm an award-winning Hall of Fame motivational speaker because of mentors. You got to understand, baby, you might be a sucker fish right now, and one day you're going to be a shark. But right now, as a sucker fish, you got to wait until the right shark comes by, and you got to connect to the shark. It's not just about you anymore. When you become a great white shark, it's about how many people can you take with you? How many people can you make successful? If you want to be a shark, they are always hunting. They are always looking. They are always grinding. You got to get to that next level through your movement. You got to get to that next level through your activity. You got to get to that next level by how you operate. I mean, that LeBron just move a little different than every other athlete. Doesn't Tom Brady just move a little different than all the other quarterbacks? Jay-Z, Beyonce, they just move a little different than everybody else. So if you want to be the top, if you want to get to the top, you got to move different. You got to move better. You got to operate different. You got to attack different. You got to think different. You got to be different if you want to be at the top of your food chain. Sharks are powerful creatures that run the ocean. Don't you want to run things? <laughs>